Hello friends, this is Brother Carlos. Let's just go ahead and get ready here uh, for another ministration. I'm here by uh, the coast of California. It's called Pismo Beach area. Amen. So let's just go ahead now and minister, you know, over those people who, are, who have been suffering with uh, rejection, abandonment feeling, and also curses. Uh, also, uh, depression, suicidal thoughts, and infirmity, sickness, pain. Let's just go ahead and address these devils right now. Amen? Uh, Father, we, let's go ahead and pray. Father, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, we just ask you right now that you camp your angels. First of all, that you forgive us of all sins we have committed against you and against those made in your image. Father, I ask right now, according to your word in Psalm 34, verse 7, which says the angel of the Lord encamps around those who fear him and he delivers them. Father, I ask right now that you camp your angels around all of us here, participating of this prayer. I ask right now that you camp your angels around us, around our loved ones, family members, ministry partners, in-laws, ex-in-laws, and friends, to protect us and keep us safe from any form of retaliation or attacks of the devil and his demons. And we declare Isaiah 54, 17, no weapon formed against us shall prosper in the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. <clears throat> the Bible says in the book of Luke chapter 10, verse 19, I have given you authority to trample on snakes and scorpions and to overcome all the power of the enemy and nothing will harm you. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth, I now command every demonic spirit, principalities and powers, I command you right now to bow down to Christ right now. Every spirit, take your nasty, dirty hands of everyone here participating with me in this broadcast. Take your nasty, dirty hands off of us, off our loved ones, family members, uh, uh, also off my ministry partners in Jesus' mighty name. I now command... All curses to be broken, curses related to rejection and abandonment, child neglect. In the name of Jesus Christ, curses, I declare now you broken and destroyed in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. And all the evil spirits now cast out, spirits of rejection, abandonment, neglect, child abuse. In Jesus' mighty name, I command you now to come out in Jesus' mighty name. Come out in Jesus' mighty name. Come out in Jesus' mighty name, right now, in Jesus' mighty name. I command you right now, spirits of depression and suicide, get out now. I cast you out into the pit. Go now to the pit in Jesus' mighty name. Go now to the pit in Jesus' mighty name. I command you now to dislodge from our loved ones, our family members, from ourselves right here, from the people watching this video. Get out right now, depression. Get out suicidal thoughts, sadness, in Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. I command you now to take your nasty dirty hands off. Everyone now participating with me in this broadcast. And also their family members, my family members, in Jesus' mighty name. I now command the spirits of infirmity, pain, sickness. Come out now in Jesus' mighty name. You are enemies of the living God. You are enemies of God's people. I command you right now, evil spirits, take your necessary hands off everyone here right now. Everyone and also including our loved ones and our family members. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Infirmity, pain, sickness. Go now to the pit. You evil spirits, go now to the pit. And I declare all curses broken and destroyed. All curses broken and destroyed. All curses broken and destroyed now. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Father, we just praise you. Father, we praise you for creating the ocean we praise you for creating the ocean thank you what a beautiful thing father the ocean we praise we magnify you father for who you are thank you for setting us free thank you for touching us today thank you father for strengthening us 
Thank you, Father, for the sacrifice of Jesus Christ on the cross of Calvary 2,000 years ago. Because of his sacrifice, we are saved. We are saved and we are set free. Jesus Christ came to set the captives free. Isaiah 61 verse 1 says that Jesus Christ came to heal the brokenhearted and to set at liberty those who are bound in jesus mighty name and that's you and your family that's me my family we are free we are set free because of the sacrifice of jesus christ because of his power because of his shed blood on the cross of calvary amen hallelujah if you are not saved just confess jesus christ as your lord and savior amen find a christian a bible believing christian church also Try to get baptized as soon as possible. Amen. Hallelujah. So let me pray a final prayer right now. Father, I ask right now that you seal this deliverance and that you fill every empty spot vacated by unclean spirits with the presence of the Holy Spirit in everyone's bodies, minds, souls, and spirits, including ourselves and including our loved ones and also my ministry partners. Father, we just thank you. Hallelujah for your word. We thank you for your word. We thank you for salvation. We thank you for redemption. We thank you for freedom. Freedom that only Jesus Christ can bring us. Father, we just magnify your holy name. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Hello, friends. This is Brother Carlos with some updates here about my situation. Okay, some of you already know things are not going well right now for lack of income. Okay, some of you already know because I made other videos before. I do not monetize on YouTube. My channels have been restricted since 2012. It's been already 12 years. So ever since then, I've been recording videos, helping people as much as I can, hosting seminars here and there. You know, and uh, thank God uh, over the years I was able to help a lot of people. People have gotten miracles and healing and deliverance, complete deliverance over the years. You know, through this, the job, through the work that I've been doing over the past 12 plus years, right? So um, I put up a couple of videos out there explaining my situation that I do not monetize on YouTube and I've been receiving donations for this past 12 years. But the problem is YouTube is shrinking my viewership to, to the point that, you know, I, I'm not getting views anymore. You know, maybe 20, 30 views a day, you know, used to be, you know, 2,000, 3,000, 5,000 a day, some, in some cases even more. So I am, uh, I have received some donations from some of you. Thank, thank you for, you know, sowing a financial seed here. I have a couple of deadlines to meet, very urgent deadlines, okay? And I appreciate if you guys can help with anything you can, okay? So, you know, uh, I just gotta meet these deadlines and if I don't meet them, I'm in trouble. So, you know, I might be on the streets. So I really appreciate your help. I really appreciate your help. Anything you can do, you're doing for God. Okay, I've been serving God for 35 years. Whatever you sow into this ministry, you're doing for God. You're honoring God through my life, calling, and ministry. I pray that things will get better sooner, you know, rather than later, so I can get on back on my feet again, you know, because my passion is helping people spiritually. That's where my passion is. I appreciate any help you can, you can help me with right now, financial help. You can donate below this video if you are on YouTube or if you are on my website also, it's below the video. Okay, I have uh, donation links there. Please honor God through my calling here, through this ministry. Okay, honor God. Help me. Okay, donate what you can. Okay, God bless you now and I will record more videos in the near future, you know, telling you guys how things are going. God bless you now. Bye.